welcome to the presentation of the subject Tourism and Civilizations of Antiquity, belonging to the degree of tourism. This subject aims to offer students a specific vision of historical and heritage aspects, useful for their personal development in the world of tourism and cultural travels. This subject mixes the study of history with tourist aspects, such as places to visit, itineraries, or the valorization of our cultural heritage. Some specific cases will be studied from materials that will be proposed through the virtual classroom, so it will be especially necessary for students to be decisively involved in the development of the subject. The course is divided into four large blocks that will be considered crosswise from some examples of civilizations of antiquity and the importance that these have had throughout history. We will treat history as part of that historical cultural heritage and the influence it has had on the development of various tourist destinations. We will take care of some classic consolidated tourist destinations and other emerging or conflicting tourist destinations with the study of some examples. We will visit some conflicted destination of ancient Mesopotamia that may have great, great potential in the future. We will discover trips on Egypt's Nile River and wonders such as the pyramids of Giza, Abu Zimbel or Saqqara. We will discover about main historical tourist attractions of Greece and Turkey. In Italy, we will travel to the eternal city, Rome, where we can understand the importance of this culture for Europe and the world. There, we will get lost between the Colosseum, the Pantheon or the Mount Statue. We will also talk about other sites such as Pompeii or some Etruscan sites such as Taquinia or Cerveteri. Finally, we will focus on the nearest, the study of the cultural tourist offer of the Iberian Peninsula, from the aqueduct of Segovia to the archaeological complex of Tarraco, not forgetting small sites not so well known, such as Acenipo in Ronda, Malaga. It is important that you read the teaching guide carefully and take care of the indications on the agenda that will be offered throughout the course through the virtual classroom. You will be able to contact me and the other colleagues using the tools of the virtual classroom. It will be especially necessary to pay attention to the development of the forums and the first video class, in which several clarifications on the subject will be given. For the virtual classroom, some materials of many kinds will be proposed to comment. In conclusion, you are about to begin a small journey to antiquity in which you will learn about the remnants of civilizations that today are a fundamental part and engine for international tourism. Enjoy the subject. Thank you.